Hey guys, it's Abby, and today I have the Ipsy Open Studios for you guys. If you don't know, Ipsy is a beauty subscription. They have three subscription boxes or bags. They have the $13 one, which you get five sample size products. They have the Ipsy Glam Bag Plus, which you get five full size products, and you can pick three that go in there. And then they have the X, which is every three months, it's $55, and um, you can pick a product that goes in there, I think one product, and you get like eight to nine full size higher end products. And they do collabs like with Khloe Kardashian, Patrick Ta, um, who else? Oh, what's her name? Halsey. So, oh, Huda. So they do collabs with that for that box, and that's every three months. So here is the Ipsy Open Studios. They sent me to this for review, and they do that every month. I did not pay for this. They sent it to me. A lot of people have gotten theirs already. Um, I just just ate a chunk of lipstick. I can taste it. Mmm, delicious. I received this the other day. I just haven't filmed it yet. Oh, the bags are so cute. You guys, I love tie-dye. Here's the Glam Bag Plus bag. How cute. We match. We're matching today. I didn't feel like getting changed. That's why I'm wearing this sweatshirt. It's dirty. It's raggedy. And my pajama shirt's underneath this. I just didn't, I put on a full face of makeup and did not get out of my PJs and I'm wearing slippers. Really dirty, gross slippers that are cheap that I got at my FabFitFun, which I'm so disappointed in. I got them like three weeks ago and I've worn them only maybe a handful of times and there's already a hole. So that's how cheap they are. Anyway, it's not like I'm tap dancing in them or running outside in the woods. I'm walking around my house and my house doesn't have nails in the floor. Anyway, here is the... Glam Bag Plus, and then here is the little Glam Bag, and how cute. You guys, I'm obsessed. I think this is my favorite bag yet. I don't think that I've had a bag that I am more happy with than this one. All right. Um, January 2022. This month and year, make time for the things that make you smile. Soft pastel shadows, your fave pop, your fave podcast, DIY manis. When you invest in bliss, the world becomes a brighter place. Amen. That's true. So the theme is happy vibes. And um, all right, let's see what's in the glam bag. There's dust flying everywhere. Okay, so the first thing I'm pulling out is a brush and this is a paddle brush it's by hip dot i really like hip dot shadows so here it is it's an ombre of a what is this a ferrule this is a precise brush what is it? these are called ferrules right or is this a ferrule handle and ferrule i don't know anyway the handle is an ombre and it's a flat brush right here so i probably use this for a concealer so we got this, not mad at that. Then there is the Pore Professional Light Primer by Benefit. I don't know if I've used this. It says, instantly blur and refine the look of pores for 12 hours. Feels weightless and breathable with a refreshing cool sensation. This must be new. Oh my goodness, this is such a little baby. That is so small, like teeny tiny. Okay, then we have this, and this is by Shayna B. Miami, and it is a pressed pigment duo. Venetian Gray and Queen of Diamonds. Let's see. Here we go. I am not gonna swatch those just because I won't use these shades. Um, I just won't, I won't use these shades, but they're pretty. Then we have this, and this is the Honey Jarrett Lip Sleeping Mask in Lemon Honey, and it's right here. And it looks like that. And the last but not least in my bag is this. And this is a Polish Exfoliant Lip Scrub for last, by Lasting Smiles. And um, yeah, it's just a lip scrub. Okay. So that is what you could possibly get in your bag for 
January 2022. I don't think that it was very good, personally. If I got this for myself, I wouldn't be, like, super excited about it. But I wouldn't be mad at it because we did get a new Benefit product, a sleeping mask for your lips, which I don't really use. Um, eyeshadow, we did get some makeup and a brush. I mean, it wasn't terrible. It just wasn't my favorite. All right, so for the Glam Bag, we received the Glam Bag Plus, which is full-size products. You could receive a... Koa Life Mist Me Rejuvenating Toner. Improves the appearance of skin tone, reduces visibility of aging, nourishes and calms the skin, tones, firms, and strengthens. So we got this. And here we go. So there's the toner. Not super excited. Then we got this is the kimchi chic stage proof matte setting spray it's a matte finish cruelty free vegan paraben free phthalate free sulfate free it's a whole bunch of freeze i'm not mad at getting a setting spray oh that's cute there we go it's cute i like the i like the colors let's try the mist has a weird smell it doesn't have a scent to it but it has like a weird scent does that make sense like you can tell that they don't want it to have a scent but it smells like um I, I don't know it smells like a chemical but it's adorable okay then I received a hair mask by Rose and Quartz and this is love unconditionally hair mask loves deeply transcend dry damage and breakage to experience soft silky shine Okay, there's rosewater, sweet violet in there. And my nose is itching. This is 30 milliliters, so it's one fluid ounce. I guess this is a full-size product. I don't know, but I needed this yesterday because my hair is so, like, dry right now. Okay, then we have the hashtag do you. And this is a hydrating lip gloss. I've never heard of this company. Have you? I haven't. Let's see. Aren't my nails cute? I love the thumb. It's a little smiley face. And then I have these. These are the, um, the Press On Shop nail gels. They're so good. Oh, that's pretty. Okay, so here's a gloss. It's really pretty. Okay, and this is in the shade Champagne. Champagne. And then the last but not least is this. And this is by Ico London. I really like Ico London mascara and their eyeliners. They're some of my favorites. And this is a Black Magic Cocoa Edit Liquid Eyeliner in the shade Brown. Okay. I don't normally get brown liquid liner, so I'm super happy that I have a different shade of eyeliner and there we go yeah I'm excited that we got a different shade of eyeliner I don't know how I scratched my hands up I woke up this morning I had a scratch on this hand two scratch on this hands and I'm like did my cat attack me did my husband attack me someone attack me um all right Ooh, I almost hit myself in the face with that Okay, so for the month of January 2020, 2022, I received the Ico London Brown Eyeliner, the Kimchi Setting Spray, the Koa Life Toner, a hair mask, and, oh, the hashtag Do You Lip Gloss. I thought it was okay. It wasn't my favorite. Again, this isn't my favorite. It's not terrible, but it's not my favorite. My favorite thing in the box were the bags this month. I love tie-dye. I'm all for tie-dye, so I like these. They're not my favorite, but it's not bad. For $28, I mean, you should get a little bit more for $28. Like, maybe a different, maybe an eyeshadow palette or something like that. But, okay, that is it for today, guys. Let me know what you thought about the Ipsy Glam bags for January 2022. Did you like them? Did you not like them? What are you getting in your boxes? And um, that is it for today. Let me know what you thought about this. And I will make sure to link Ipsy in my description box down below so you can go check it out for yourself. 
Thanks for hanging out with me. I love you guys so, so much. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!